Hello students, now come to the next exercise 6.2 of this chapter, question number A. We need to find 1 by 3 of 18. So I have chosen some questions from this uh, question number A. 1 is 1, 3rd, 5th and 7th question, okay. Rest you will try at home. So this one, find 1 by 3 of 18. I will show this thing by di diagrammatically and by the actual calculation which you have to do in your copies. Okay, see here. First, let's do this one. So, 1 by 3 solution. 1 by 3 of 18. So, let's draw 18. Suppose 18 balls here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 parts. So, this 18 part I have to divide into 3 equal parts. 3 equal parts. See here. 1, 18. Now. So, if we 6, 3 is 18. So, take 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. If I take this set in as a one part one two three four five six this one as a one part is that clear and this one as a one part one two three four five six now you can understand here see here this 18 part 18 balls are divided into three equal parts and one by three means this will be your one by three is that clear how many balls? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 balls will be 1 by 3 of 18 out of 18 balls. Is that clear or not? It's very simple. 18 balls are separated into 3 different packets. 3 different packets. And each packet contains equal. As I told you, we will divide it equally. So these 18 are divided into 3 equal packets. No? Each packet is containing how many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 balls. So, we can write this thing in like this. 1 by 3. Off means your multiplication 18. It means what? This will look like this. 1 into 18 by 3. Can we write like this? Because here also 1. So, we don't need any final necessity to write 18 by 1 here. Okay. So, 1 by 3 into 18 means 1 into 18 by 3. It means 1. 18 by 3. If we divide it, if we divide 18 by 3, 3, 6, 18. So we are getting 6 as I told you. So 1 by 3 of 18 will be 6. And from figure also we can see this is 1 part, 2 part, 3 part. 1 part out of 3 part. 1 part out of 3 part gives you how many balls? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I hope you have understood this part. Now come to the next one. This, is, this one is for solution of 1. Okay. Now come to 3 1. Now let me wrap this one. Okay. For third. Third. 3 by 4 of 24. 24. See 4. 6. No. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. See, how many balls? 24 balls. We have to divide this thing in four equal parts. So see, I, you know, what I did exactly to draw this one, I did the calculation in my mind. See, 6 fours means 6 equal balls will be there in four parts 6 6 6 6 gives 24 so that's why i have draw the thing like this this is the one part okay this is the second part or you can say packet let let's uh, assume these are sweets packet and these are what sweets we can say let do <laughs> whatever you want to say that anyway so all 24 sweets are divided into four equal packets four Packets equally, equally divided. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, 3 out of 4 packets. If we take 3 packets out of 4 packets, how many sweets we have? See, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 sweets we will get. Am I right or not? Tell me. From here, 6. From here, 6. From here, 6. If we add all these, 6, 6, 6. 18 sweets we will get. Okay. 3 box out of 4 box. See, 3 box out of 4 boards. box. See how we will do. 3 by 4 into 24. Can I write like this? 3 into 24 by 4. Now see, if we multiply these two, it will become a huge value. Again, we have to divide this thing by 4. And you know why uh, the function of mathematics is what? To make it simple, to make it very easy to understand. So what we will do? Instead of multiplying here, let's divide this thing. 4, 6 is 24. We will write 4, 1 is 4, 4, 6 is 24. So now it will look like 3 into 6. How much? 6 is 18. C. By calculation, we are getting 18. And by diagrammatic also, we are getting 18. Is that clear? But remember, please student, you no need to draw this thing in your copy. This is for explanation purpose. For explanation, I am drawing this thing here in your board. Simply, you will do like this. Okay? You can directly cut here also. But I draw this line and put this 24 and 3 in the numerator place and 4 in the denominator place and then I cancel it out. You can simply cut it here also from here also 24 means 24 by 1 means 24 is in the numerator place. So it will be multiplied by the numerator. That's why I have written 3 into 24. Is that clear? So you will do in this way and this is for me to make you explain the explanation purpose that's why i have drawn this thing but if you would like to draw this thing for your own you know it, you want to make it very beautiful so you can draw this type of figures any type of figure you can choose it okay now come to the next one five okay five 16 16 balls i have to draw this is five okay one by four of 16 16 balls 1 2 3 4 again if i do the calculation here 4 4 is 16 the four sets we required 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 c 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 so four packets we have to make Four packets see in one packet four sweets, another packet four sweets, another packet four sweets, another packet four sweets. How many packets we have? We have four packets. Why? This 16 has to be divided into four equal parts. So these four equal parts we can see here. See one, two, three, four. In four packets we have distributed our 16 sweets. And each packet contains four sweets. So one packet out of four packets. So one packet. One packet out of four packets. How many sweets we have? Only four sweets. Here also we can write four sweets. And in from calculation also we will see one by four into sixteen. Either you can cancel it here itself or like this also by four. Simply sixteen one is sixteen by four. We can have four four is sixteen. If you cancel it out like this four. So from diagrammatically also you are getting four, and for calculation also you are getting four. So now come to the last one seven seven okay now it is 36 balls we have to draw seven okay one by six of 36 36 balls see if i do calculation six six or 36 now nah? so this this 36 is divided into six packets see one two three four five six one two three four five six 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 packets, see, 1 packet 6, then 12, then 18, 24, 28 and 36. Is it clear? See. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 9, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. 36 sweets. Okay. Let me put some cherries here. Okay. <laughs
these are cherries on sweets anyway uh, just a joke here so you know 36 is divided into six parts see six packets 36 sweets have to be distributed equally in six packets six packets one two three four five six packets are here and we have divided all the sweets equally so each packet contains how many sweets six sweets so one packet out of six packet how much we are getting one packet out of six packet means one packet in one packet how many sweets we are getting six sweets one two three four five six so by calculation also we will show 1 by 6 into 36 again I would like to write 1 into 36 by 6 into 36 by 6 now 6 6 is 36 if we cancel it out we are getting 6 here so by calculation also we are getting 6 here and by diagrammatically also I have shown you how much we are getting we are 6 here is that clear so I hope you have understood this part very easily thank you